Hey, okay. Gonna be playing some Link's Awakening. I did play a bit on a stream recently. Oh, my camera is a little high. There we go. Um, but uh, yeah, I I died, and I want to get the secret ending. Which to do that, you have to. You have to not die once throughout the entire game. So we're gonna actually start a new file and go from there. Um, haven't been streaming a lot recently. Apologies for that. Uh, I, I've done a few from the living room. You know, I did a couple Jack and Daxter. I tried out doing a couple of no mic ones, but nobody seems super interested in those. Whatever. I was just playing GTA 5, so I was having a good time. And uh, yeah, gonna gonna try and get back to it. I just I've started playing piano over the last few months. Um, which I practice every day, and that doesn't take up a ton of time, but, you know, it takes up enough. And I also uh, started doing weight training, now that I'm vaccinated and can get to the gym. So, you know, I... It's great, I enjoy it, um, but it takes up a lot of time. It's like three hours a day, I gotta eat so often, so... <laughs> That's that's just been consuming a lot of my time. And I got really busy with work, which is, you know, usually a good thing because that means more money's coming in. But uh, with all of that said, let's get into Link's Awakening right here. And as usual, let me know if there's anything wrong with the audio or the video. I was having a bit of frame rate problems um, before, but hopefully I won't have that issue again. Okay. So yeah, we were going with Streamsicle. Hmm? Oh, the bumpers, right. The bumpers are L and R. The triggers are Z, L, and Z, R. Okay. Uh, now we're just gonna go normal. Cause I'm gonna, 100%ing uh, it is the challenge here. And yeah, we're gonna go with, uh, oh, there it is. Stream sickle again, which I have to kind of fudge it to fit. Stream sickle <laughs> works for me. It's just so that I can remember which file is which. All right, here we go. The Legend of Zelda: Link's Awakening. There it was. He awoke. What a relief! I thought you'd never wake up. You were tossing and turning. What? Zelda? No, my name's Marin. You must still be feeling a little woozy. You are on Koho Lint Island. Cool. Is this a stand for something? It says Goomba. Oh, I was trying to talk to her, but... Uh, there we go. Follow the lane south to reach the beach where I found you. Since you washed ashore, lots of nasty monsters have been in the area, so be careful, okay? Well, Streamsicle, you finally snapped out of it. Name's Theron. Hope you're feeling better. What? I don't know your name. You think it's weird, eh? Well, I saw it on the back of the shield. You got your shield back. Hold R to repel enemies with it. I'm gonna have to remember to do that because I'm actually pretty bad at, a. Uh, you know, using the shield in most Zeldas. So get on me about that. Load times are a bit long. All right, hopefully the frame rate isn't too bad. It was a little choppy last time, but you know, it's not too bad. Part of it's also that I'm, it, the game itself I think is at like, higher than 30 FPS, but I'm only streaming it at 30 FPS, so, yeah. Ah, okay, the trigger works too. Get out of here. Get out of here with your octa rocking. Uh, whoops, that's the way to the first dungeon. I'm gonna go around. And I won't necessarily talk a ton throughout this. I mean, I I always say that, like, oh, I'm not gonna talk that much, but I can't, I can't help it. I end up, oh, I just end up talking up a storm. But, you know, whatever. Hopefully people find it entertaining. But I'm, I'm mostly trying to save my voice because I anticipate these being long streams. I am planning on 100%ing this, you know, all the secret seashells and everything. So, hopefully it goes well. Ooh. 
Tootoot, so you are the lad who owns the sword. Now, I understand why the monsters are starting to act so violently. A courageous lad has come to wake the windfish. It is said that you cannot leave the island unless you wake the windfish. You should now go north to the mysterious forest. I will wait for you there, Hoot. I'm trying desperately not to be like derivative of Game Grumps, but I've watched their playthrough uh, fairly recently. So, if if I start doing any of their voices, apologies. It's just it's out of love. You found your sword. It must be yours because it has your name engraved on it. You can swing with B to attack any enemies in your path. I do like um, that it was added to the canon with this game that Link monograms all of his stuff. Or is it, monogram might just be initials. But whatever, he he writes his name on all of his items. That's cute. Alright, uh, that guy wants canned food, so let's come back later when we have some. I don't remember what the monkey's deal is, but whatever. Oof, yeah, the frame rate. When there's a few objects on screen, the frame rate tanks a touch. Ooh. Apologies, apologies. Not a lot I can do about it. Just need to get a better computer at some point. Like I love the uh I love the MacBook I have, but it's just not really powerful enough for streaming. Alright. Then I'm pretty sure. I want to go up to the mysterious forest, which is this way. Hmm. Ah, the owl again already. Ooh, oh, brave lad on your quest to wake the dreamer. Welcome to the mysterious forest. Much of mystery you will find on this uncharted Koholint island. I'm afraid you may find it a trifle difficult to leave the island while the windfish naps. By the by, have you ever visited the Tail Cave, which is south of the village? Go there with the key you find in the forest. The windfish is watching. Hoot! I think I said this on my last stream of this, but, uh... Koholint is not uncharted? It's... Everything's, like, named. And people live here. What is this Christopher Columbus nonsense? Yeah. Get him. Get him. Oh, we'll come back to you. I need, a, need some of that powder. Oh my god, am I almost dead already? I gotta be more careful. I gotta manage a perfect run if I want that secret ending. I got 50 rupees. Very nice. Little bear, I got your rupees. Very good. Wasn't the whole point of Origel toothpaste that you could just like swallow it safely? So kids who are don't have the motor control to like, you know, not swallow wouldn't poison themselves with fluoride. I don't even use fluoride. I get, I use, uh, what is it? Toms of Maine. Fluoride free. You pick the toadstool. As you hold it over your head, a mellow aroma flows into your nostrils. Not that I don't necessarily have anything specifically against fluoride. It's just that's the toothpaste my grandma would always get, and I... It always made me feel extra fresh. And now that, you know, I've found out that Lush is a garbage company full of bastard people. I can't get their tooth tabs I used to do. Uh, it sucks. I, I, I really like those tooth tabs. I just 
I don't know, maybe there's like a knockoff version I could get. In fact, why haven't I looked into that? I've just been miserable and like, this is just life now. That's just my life in general, man. That's that's the thing, is when you grow up poor, you're just like, well, I don't have any control over this. Life just sucks. But it's like, I'm not... I'm, I'm, like, I'm not friggin' rich or anything, but I'm doing well enough that I can actually get the things I like. Like, I remember having a moment like that. I was in the grocery store, and... I saw, like, a jar of Verde Salsa, and I was like, Oh, man, I really love Verde Salsa. Too bad it's not on the list. And then I just stood there for a second. I was like, wait, why do I care? I made the list. It's $2. So I got myself a jar of delicious Verde Salsa and had a great time. Ah, it has the sleepy toadstool it does. We'll mix it up something in a jiffy, we will. I love this kangaroo ring. Hopping. It's all right, it is. Take care, as there's not much there. Why not try a bit in my hut? Nice. Uh, there. Good job! Use it on your enemies and see what happens. If you run out, go to the forest, pick some toadstools, and I will make you more. Come back without a toadstool, and you may have to pay a price for my leftovers. Lift. Oh yeah, you can't even lift pots in this until you get the, uh... Power Glove, Titan's Mitt, whatever one. It ch they change the name every game. Ah, I love that. He gets the big googly eyes. Yeah, it's, speaking of, like, being, like, not treating yourself, I've just had horrible anxiety lately, and it took me a bit to figure out why, and it's like, I'm, like, the healthiest I've been in years. I'm doing super well with, like, my business and such. I mean, okay, not super well, but, like, I'm back up to the my previous peak, and I think I might even be doing a bit better than that. So, you know, I'm I'm not doing amazing, but I'm I'm doing well enough that I'll I'll be able to pay off my debt in a few months and everything. Um, and I was just like, everything's going great for me. Why do I feel so anxious? Why do I feel like something's wrong? And I realized it's because I was living so stressfully for so long that my brain it can't fathom the idea that things are going good for me. That I'm just... It's just like... I, I, I feel like I don't deserve to be happy, so I'm just like, something has to go wrong. Something's, something's wrong, I'm missing something. And it's just like, put me really on edge. Uh, the last thing I can remember was buying into a big juicy toast duel. Then I had the darndest dream. I was a raccoon. Yeah, sounds strange, but sure was fun. Um, <laughs> if I hadn't done that, I would have just gotten like trapped here. It's like a Lost Woods thing. But yeah, I I'm just you know I'm trying to be mindful of that. I don't know. Maybe I should meditate. I I do it like very rarely, but I. Anytime I do, it's it's nice. It's just kind of chilling out for a bit, you know? Uh, I need a drink. Ooh, let's take the key and go to the tail cave. Retrieve the instrument that is hidden there. Go now! The wind fish is waiting. Hoot! Uh, well, hold on. I'm going to go see what's over here real quick. The thing is, a lot of the seashells I can't get until I have, um, the shovel. So, I'm gonna have to kind of backtrack after I get that, but I'm pretty sure that's one of the things you buy. So I'll probably get it after the tail cave here. My hope is that I do not die, because if I can get up to five hearts, I'm usually pretty good. Um, 
but it's at this point when I still only have three or four that I get a little risky and sometimes I, get, I sneak in like one death and that's that's what's really gonna mess me up because any deaths and you're just you're done in this one uh, oh yeah there's the a not so subtle secret right here oh man seeing people in the oath LFG I gotta I gotta play more oath soon I have the physical version I've only played it once you know um, I'm gonna do some board games this weekend probably and I think I'll do some clockwork prints uh, with the webcam setup. I think that'd be cool. Um, I, I only have the one webcam. So, being able to show you guys the actual thing. Well, hmm. I might be able to work out a way using the, the, the laptop webcam I'm using right now. And the external webcam I usually use for my tabletop streams. If I can work it correctly, I might be able to do both? I'm not sure. I don't know. I do really want to go back to doing more regular streams. It's just I gotta work it around working out, and I gotta work it around work, like during the week, which is really difficult. Today, I don't really mind. There's usually only one or two things that end up popping up on uh, my preferred platforms. In fact, let me check that real quick. Anything coming through? Uh, nope. Nothing. Yeah, that's that's fine. I've had a very busy week. Um, so... I don't mind if my weekend be is, uh, a little slow. I deserve time off, dang it. That's the big thing. I have to keep telling myself I deserve... Time off. Cause like my brain is just like you have to keep working, keep working, keep working, and it's like, no, no, I can relax. How do I Oh, I can just swap them. Swap them right away. I got the key. Also, apologies for being kinda in shadow. I have to have my window open for the tree, so um I'm a little too backlit for my, my light to handle, but huh, I do what I can. Hopefully you can see me well enough that if I do like a, uh, 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 any faces you can tell. Okay, you got a small key. And a treasure chest, uh-oh, fire. The fire and the flames. Dragon Force tried to warn me. You got the compass. And it makes a noise if uh, a key is nearby. Or it, I'm pretty sure also a chest. Could be wrong on that. All right. Just gotta be real mindful so as not to die. The big thing is gonna be getting all of the secret seashells because there's like hundreds of them. So many. Some of them are in dungeons, a lot of them are buried. But if you get them all, you get the super cool sword. I don't think it's the master sword. Partially because at this point they, you know, hadn't super established the master sword. This was, I think, the fourth Zelda game? I think? I can't remember if it came out before or after Link's Awakening. At last, you got a map. Here it is. Nice. Uh, ooh, do I wanna? Uh, well, I could, I'll go this way first, because it won't lock me in. Bats, bats. Keys. Uh-oh, uh-oh. <laughs> oh. The thing about Zelda holes is always that, like, slight, like, hole it has, it's like gravity that just kind of like gently tugs it at your character. 
again, I gotta come back here with a bomb once I get one. Uh, I do have keys, but I'm gonna come back after I wreck shop on some fools. Okay, three keys. That's a bit, that's, you know, quite a few. 20 rupees, joy! Joy, joy, joy. Uh, oh, actually, this looks like it's missing my no, I guess not. Let me get the skeleton, get him right here. Slam. Okay. Pretty sure you get the rock's feather in just the, oh. Right, you have to actually walk through the door. What, did, how'd you, okay. Oh yeah, puzzles. Ah, frick. Oh, oh, it's after clubs, huh? Which spades clubs? No, that's out of order. Um, the the hierarchy. A lot of people don't realize there's a hierarchy to the suits, where um, it goes spades, hearts, diamonds, clubs. Spade uh, spades. The ace of spades is the coolest card, you know, t traditionally. Hearts. Uh, you have to use diamonds to get someone's heart, so clearly hearts are worth more than diamonds, and then clubs are the throwaway. Which I find sad. That's uh, one of the reasons my favorite card is the four of clubs. Because, uh, you know, why not? Clubs deserve lubs. L love? Yeah, whatever. Alright. Yeah, I don't think you can get bombs until much later. I don't necessarily need to do that. I could get by fast enough. I'm just playing it safe. Ooh, careful. No, no, no. Get up. Get up. Yeah, I don't think those guys hurt you. Um, but they definitely slow you down. Good. Uh, oh yeah, the shield. Feel so bad, they're just gentle little turtle boys. Why must I harm them? Why must I harm these turtles? Whoa, 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 whoa. Right. I always forget, because I'm like, Goomba, Mario rules. No, Zelda rules. Sword. Here we go now. Well. It's the rock's feather. That will go permanently on Y. Because why not? Hiff, 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 hiff. Oof. The animation on his little somersault is a little frustrating. He goes like feet first, which is not, not how the flipping works. That's just bad physics. It doesn't look as bad, um, you know, in the top down, it's just the side scrolling. It's like, ugh. I don't like that very much. Uh, there was something over here. Gotta get the skeleton once again. And back. Come here. Come here, let me kill you. No, not today. Whoop. 
Oh, here's this guy. No. Don't have anything to say, huh? Don't have anything to say. Don't want to say anything to me. Jiggling. Uh, I don't need the fairy right now. Ooh. I am very glad that I, uh, waited there. That could have been bad. Heart, hearts, that's it? Okay, that's pretty dark. The skeletons hanging by their necks. Ooh. That's, that's very dark for a Zelda game. I mean, I guess that was the direction they felt like going. Uh, what else do I have? Whoops, almost took a screenshot. Uh, I got up there. Let's see, I, I can get up here. Uh, can't get over here yet because I need a bomb, but I will come back. Yeah, that's... That should be fine. Knock it off, you ruddy skellington. Ooh, ooh, they make a nice noise when you whack them. Sort of a boom, boom. That's good. That's good stuff. There it is, the nightmare key. Yeah, what a, what a straightforward dungeon. Real cut and dry. You get the item, you get the key, you go to the boss. That's it. No, no fat on it at all. Honestly, uh, top tier tutorial dungeon. Like it, it shows you everything you need to know about how dungeons work. In this particular Zelda. Whoa! Okay. Watch out. There we go. All right, let me, whoop. Let me take a drink while I'm in safety. Ah, uh, hamburger. Bzz, bzz, outsider. Hamburger. Whoa, 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 whoa. Reveal your weak point. Ooh. Um, now that my roommate's back, like, uh, RE8 came out basically like a week after he left, which was really sad for him because he loves that series, but, uh, he's been playing through it for the first time, and it... Oh, it's just getting me excited about Resident Evil again. I, I, I'm gonna stream. I gotta do the speed run, um, achievement where you get, beat the game in less than three hours. It's gonna be rough. I'm not, uh, I'm not super good at it. So I'll probably do it on like casual mode or something. But I'm, I'm gonna do it at some point. Um, I just, I gotta practice probably a little bit. I still gotta finish it on hardcore as well. Uh, and then Village of Shadows! Ugh, so much, so much. You got the full moon cello. Hmm, beautiful. Okay. Swamp. A path opens in the burbs. Sure. All right, first dungeon down, I believe. Oh, cutscene, that's why I couldn't pause. Oh, that is an instrument of the sirens. I have to admit, at first I did not believe you were real. 
That instrument, along with the seven others in the set, has the power to wake the windfish. You must collect them all. I was instructed to give you directions. Your next goal is north in Kapunga Swamp. Oot indeed. All right. I got it in like half an hour, looks like, so that's pretty good. Um, yeah, this, this is one of the shorter Zeldas because, you know, it was on Game Boy originally. Um, I'm gonna 100% it, which means I will do the optional dungeon, but it's still, getting through the story is not gonna take very long. Uh, getting the 100%, that might take a bit longer. What's up, guys? Hey, buddy, it's serious. Yeah, I'm really serious. Yeah, it is, the moblins came to the village. Yeah, that's right, old gang of moblins. That is for real, they all went to the house. Yeah, that house, and then they did some at Bow Wow's house. It was a really bad scene with the b b moblins. So, I mean, yeah. Might be faster to find out for yourself what happened. Stupid kids. Hello? Oh, it's terrible. My Bow Wow was dognapped by m m moblins. Oh, ah, please, somebody help my poor Bow Wow. Clip the mic there a little bit. Apologies. It's an intense scene. Hold on, I'm gonna swing over here to see uh, how much I need for the shovel. And uh, bombs. Come on now. Uh, ooh, mm, no, this is incorrect. Well, I could, no, no, no. I'll do that later. Got a notification. Hey, one of the seashells, perfect. You found a secret seashell. But what do you do with it? I'll never tell. Okay, let's get in here. Doesn't sell bombs, how much is the shovel? 200? Mm. Okay, I would normally never do this because I hate grinding, but... I can just grind out... <laughs> I can just grind out 90 rupees right here. Um, yeah, as a kid, I remember doing this the most. Just this specific screen, I would clear out all the grass, pick up all the rupees, and then I would leave the screen, come back, and all the grass would be back. Uh, in this case, it'll be a little trickier because it has seamless transitions. But I think I only have to go what would basically be two screens away. And that means I can easily get these bushes too, which have a chance of having some rupees. Alright, now we walk, 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 walk. It's off screen, then we get all the way over here. Now we should be able to go back. Yes, all back. Right, and it looks like we get like 10 rupees each time, so just nine cycles of that. Riveting content. Riveting. It's got this wacky music because I'm supposed to be going to save Bow Wow, but. He'll be okay. He'll be fine. halfway there already. Okay. And again. <coughs> oh, that's a lovely, um, what you call it, life, quality of life thing that they added to this version. When you go behind something, it just kind of, uh, just kind of gently tilts. See, watch. Just kind of gently tilts so that you can see a little better. It's just, hmm. It's a very good adaptation. Yeah, sometimes you get a little bit of silliness with the, like, oh, it's... 
And this would have been where the transition was. Oh, I only have to go back behind. Well, that was a waste of my time. That's all right. We're already most of the way there. I guess you just have to get it off screen. That's not too bad. Glad I know that for later. Nice, there's a five. That saves me time. Seven more. Come on, seven. Come on, five more, five more dollars. I just need five dollars, please. It's only like five dollars, come on. Do not hit Shin Ken. There we go, 200. Buy the shovel and shovel it up. I, I especially want it for now because uh, Bow Wow like sniffs out a bunch of stuff, so I want to be able to dig. All right, we will set that to X, and we will go. I'm gonna get some water. Uh, one of the things, now that I'm weight training, I got this, which is a one gallon uh, water bottle with a straw. Which I mean, I was already drinking about a gallon of water a day just for voiceover stuff, but it's like, it just saves me time. I basically just fill it up, which takes like five minutes. It's a super long process um, at the beginning of the day, and then I I just have uh, all my water for the day. It's nice. And I know what you're thinking. Oh, it gets warm. I, I actually drink room temperature water already. So, plus... On days when my roommate's working and has to take the car, um, I have to walk to the gym, so that's like two miles in the hot sun, then a workout, then two miles back, and even hotter sun, because now it's later in the day. So, go through at least three of my regular water bottles, and the tap water at the gym sucks. It's so gross. So, like, yeah, just bringing a whole thing be overall a lot easier. I have to remember where... can't be through there because I don't have the mitt yet. Probably gonna be past somewhere I can jump. So maybe over this way? Down here. Yeah? No, that's where the mushroom's at. Oh, grab another one. Just in case I need it later. I I appreciate them. Uh, letting that linger a minute, but like, what? just let me cancel out of it if I've seen it before. Like, I do. I'm. I don't care. I've seen it. Oh yeah. Uh, before I forget, gotta put a uh, a pin here. I'll make that a circle or bomb. Because I need to be able to bomb that later when I have some. Eat. 
Zelda. Yeah. Hmm. I, I keep hitting it like B and A because I'm used to those being the buttons in most games to jump. So I think B Y is a little weird. Which doesn't start with Y, but kind of feels like it should. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, oh, that's a that's a diggable spot right there. If I ever saw one. Ne never mind. I guess not. The Guardian Acorn! Get out of here, you like like. Ah, uh, maybe it's around the other side of... Well, oh yeah, there was an area that I had to jump over on the other side of the forest. That's where I need to go. is my second one, so we're halfway to another heart. <laughs> Telltale hate. Moblins, this is the place to be. <laughs> eh, who's this suspicious looking run? Okay, boys, let's get rid of him. Oh jeez, that's a lot of spears. Dang spear throwing pigs. Moblins. Although, does it make sense for there to be moblins here? Isn't that a Ganon thing? You must be an assassin sent by Madame Meow Meow to rescue your mutt. You came here to get me, but it is I who will get you. No, thank you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. Nope, can only get him from the back, huh? Oh, jeez. Oh, please, please, please. Got him. Alright. Oh, jeez. There we go. No, 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 no. Yeah. Alright, that's three spins. A regular slash. Four, okay. Oh, thank you for the fairy. Okay. No, come here. Okay, come here. There we go. Wouldn't let me grab her, what the heck? Save Bow Wow! What a fearsome beast! What a big old fearsome beast! Oh, I love him. Let's go! You and me, Bow Bow. Bow Wow. We're here to run the world. Oh my god, every two minutes with you, dude! Get it. Oh, that is a fearsome looking animal you have there. Do not forget, the next instrument is in Gupanga Swamp. No, I got it. I didn't forget in the last, you know, friggin' ten minutes since you told me. Oh, sweet. Oh, 
Oh, oh yeah, here, obviously. It's in like a, not quite a fairy circle, but a, basically a fairy circle. No, you fool. Alright, we take him back, and then she's like, take him for a walk, and then we take him for a walk to Kaporinga Swamp. Okay. Oh, thank you. I'm so happy you brought my baby back. Now, would you be a dear and take him for a walk? It would really help me out a lot. You will, thanks. I didn't say anything. You're assuming a lot, hun. That's fine. That helps me out anyways. Oh yeah. I still have it uh, locked to uh, one of my assignable buttons. You got a piece of power. You can feel the energy flowing through you. The power glove. It's so bad. I wonder if the power glove could have worked, you know? Because the whole thing generally was that, like, the sensors were kind of crap, but I think... Specifically, the sensors would work a lot better if you were using it in the dark. It's like, it was basically just like really, um, really primitive lasers. Hey, I can climb. Music, the fish stirs in the egg. Gotta be something, right? I guess I can't do that one. Dang, two for one. Nice. Those flowers. Do it. Eat big flower. Hungry. Oof. Sludgeon and trudgeon. Guess it is a swamp. Fifty rubies. Nice. Down to two hearts. That's that's kind of low. Oops, around this way. I'm so slow. Is there some kind of secret over here? I don't think. Yeah, I can't dig in the swamp, so. I don't care. I don't care. The fish isn't worth much. Oh, thank you. All right, swamp time. Gopanga Swamp. Bottle Grotto. Bottle Grotto. Ah, need the magic powder. I don't think I can dig in here anyway, so I don't even care. I think originally this was one of the Zeldas where you could just um, take the keys wherever you wanted. They kind of phased that out right away. 
Ooh, oh, oh, shy guy. Get him. Guess I can't. Yes. Another key. It's very helpful. Uh, oh, this is just platforming. Classic platforming. Man, they really give you a ton of keys in this one. You have to get the bottles for that. Oh, didn't unlock a secret doing that. Now I just feel bad. Uh, something I really want to play on the stream sometime is a uh, power wash simulator, which is just. It's what it sounds like. You just get some dirty locations and you gotta power wash them clean. It's so satisfying. I've been watching Markiplier play it. And I'd love to do some like super chill, no camera, just like uh, maybe not even microphone streams. Like I'd probably have the mic on so I can just be like, hey, thanks for the like, thanks for watching or whatever, answer questions, but like super chill. Unfortunately, it's Windows only, and all I have is a Mac, so that's not oop, that's not gonna happen anytime soon. But it is still early access, so hopefully, sometime in the future, I can play that for y'all. I'd certainly like to. Uh oh. Anything? Whoa! No! Ouch! Let me up, let me up! Shoot. Ah! No, no! And I'll get in like his eyeball. And I'll throw some powder at him. Okay, cool. I got him. I got him. Nice. I don't even think fairies were part of this game originally. That might be just a, a remake thing. Whoops. The bats! The bats! Ah, the map. The map. Pulling. Pulling. Okay. Hey, 20 rupees. Awesome, because I'm going to do some fishing after this. Get out of here, booze. This isn't even the correct game for you. What do you expect me to do with you? There it is, the power bracelet. Now I can pick up pots and stones. And thankfully that doesn't have to be one of my items. Get a little more powder there. Ah, oh, yeah. Feels good to be able to just pick up pots again, dude. Zelda just doesn't feel like a Zelda until you can smash some pots, you know? 
Um, let me just go. Whoops. I hit it just a little too late. Hmm. Key. Whoops. Guess I messed that one up. That's alright. Uh, let me check the map. So locked door way at the end there. I'm just gonna go back here and go back to the beginning of the uh, dungeon in the mini boss room. Oh yeah, and I can do this stuff. Hold on, I'll do that real quick. Or well, no, I'm gonna go back to the beginning and do the, the, the pops. The beginning of the level, but before I do that, I'm gonna run and add. Oh, you gotta stay there for a second. I'm gonna run an ad and I'm gonna take a quick break. Um, so don't touch the internet dial. Don't go anywhere. I will be right back with more Link's Awakening in just a few minutes. All right. B R B. Hey, everybody, I am back. Let us continue. So I want to get this chest and whatever's in all of these various pots. Ugh. Um, I think I said on a stream before, but I want to do, like, a charity stream at some point. 
with, uh, uh I'd probably 100% Banjo-Kazooie again. Um, but I would do it as a marathon-style stream. I think that'd be pretty good. I don't know what charity I'm gonna do quite yet. Um, eh, but it's definitely in the cards at some point. So, stick around for that, you know, follow, uh, subscribe if you can, you know, use your Twitch Prime uh, sub, I'd appreciate that, because you get one free every month, and if you don't use it, I mean, it's just, it just goes away. Um, I haven't used mine in, in a couple months, uh, oh, feels a little selfish, I should probably do that, I need to rate it, I, I just need to stream more, I've been really spotty about it, I... I, I lost a follower over it, so, you know, if you, if whoever was following me that unfollowed because of my spotty performance, if you watch this, sorry about that. I, I'm trying to get back into it. I'm going to try and do at least one a week, preferably like three or more, you know? I, I'm trying to schedule four, so... Basically, Monday, Monday, Thursday, Saturday, Sunday. Um, whether or not I end up actually doing all of those depends on a lot of different factors, but I think it'll be a little bit easier. Hold on. Uh, ooh, how do I do this? Pretty sure I gotta throw it at him and then make him turn around so that it hits him. No, guess not. Oh, okay, yeah, the bottles were just in the way. So I was right, you just have to trick them into turning around. Well, oopsie. Nice, compass. It, yeah, I know it has a new feature. Thank you. Um, I don't think I went... Okay, I did go to the right. Let's go to the... Oh. Oh, right. I think I have to come back after I take those two out. I I ignore him. He's like that. Yep, there it is. I got a piece of power! I've got the power. Nintendo power. It's got the tools that you can use. It's got the power. Nintendo power was so awesome, dude. I really miss it. I never had a subscription or anything, because my family was just, you know, not in the financial streets to do such things. Um, but, like, I've read so many back issues from the library and stuff, and I just, I loved every minute of it. So much fun. Um, yeah, ended in, uh, what was it, 2015? It's real, real unfortunate. Uh, they do it as a podcast now, the Nintendo Power, Nintendo Power Podcast. So, you could probably check that out. Um, in fact, uh, they upload it to the Switch News Channel, so you can listen to it from your Switch. Which is a bit silly, but it makes sense. Um, I guess they're closing down the, the 3DS eShop and the uh, Wii U eShop soon, too. Which really sucks. I've, I've gotten so much stuff off of there. Um, I'm pretty sure I have it all downloaded to my DS, but I'll probably double check before the official end of the service. But I recommend you guys do that too. Oh yeah, and also go into your eShop settings um, and turn off Google Analytics. They very quietly added uh, Google Analytics data collection permissions to the new update 
And it's on by default, so go turn that off. And probably tweet at them like, hey, what is this? Stop it. Stop it. Ooh. Ooh. That was very close. Um, okay, back here. Right. Gotta do this now. Oh yeah, I can do this. That's what I was gonna do before the break. Wow, get going by. I don't think that's picking up on the microphone, so that's good. Oh, we're on a plant. We're on a plant. I love the piranha plant. There's, there's no, like, caveat to that statement. I just genuinely enjoy it. False voice! False voice! I think you can just hit him with a, uh... A, uh... Boto. Hold on. Yep, this. Although, I think this is one where you have to, like, do it in a specific order. I'm pretty sure I already messed it up. Yeah. <laughs> oh, boy. The Guardian Acorn! Um, although I think I could probably just brute force that since there's only three options, so let's do bad. Cole's voice. Skeleton. Let's see if that does it. Nope. Okay, let's do... Skeleton. Cole's voice. That. No, let's do Paul's voice. That. Skellington. There it is. Yeah, the trick there is mainly because, like, the Pole's voice is a little hard to get to, so you're rarely ever going to do it first. Nightmare key! Ah, I probably would have found something for it then. I didn't realize it was something, uh, required. Gotta have a bit of tea. Get him with his big ears. I'm curious why they haven't brought back the Pole's voice thing. Because, like, the original thing was that you would shout into a microphone on the second controller on the Famicom. And then, because they didn't do that on the Nintendo to keep controller uh, prices low, it just kind of got removed, but it's like nowadays, like, especially on the 3DS, you could totally do that again. Let me through. Let me through. Nice. the jaws that I broke. <laughs> Excuse me. My allergies have been acting up a lot lately. So I get like a cough, I get the dry eye. I get 
like the uh, dry nose sucks. Oh wow, can you just take that with me? That's very different for Zelda. All right, here we go. Ah, this guy. <laughs> I'm your bad guy this time. <laughs> Didn't even give him a clever name, did you? Whoa, whoa, stop it. Knock that off. No, thank you. Please, no. I can't move, but I am still all right. Your little sword won't break this bottle. Even the walls here look tougher than that dinky thing. That. Yeah, yeah, you can't hurt me as long as I have my bottle. Oh, we're gonna have to rectify that then, aren't we? Well then, crunch. Zelda the like totally plays off of your expectations because it's it's a very deep formula now, right? Um, why you you broke my bottle? Why you you make me happen mad? Um, and like that's fine. It can be fun. Um, and like Breath of the Wild, you know, it it definitely took the formula and like really extrapolated it out to something very fun, but now, now there's like no reason we couldn't do like a top-down Zelda like this, but then like just completely mess with the head of the player by just taking everything they expect because of the formula and just flipping it on its head. You know, I'd love to see more stuff like that. Uh, that's something, Metroid Dread is going to be coming out, and that's basically like Super Metroid, like a sequel to Super Metroid, where you can, um, but, but it's on a modern console, so it's going to be, it can be huge. And that's what I think is like, with these retro games, they always make them like similar sizes, but like you can make them gigantic without a problem because of our current stuff. Like our, our current technology. Prairie, prairie, the prairie is waiting. The prairie. The Ukuku Brady. Whoops, right. These are harmful. Oh no, oh, I could use that. Oh, whatever. <laughs> Alright, buddy, let's take you home. And I'm gonna do some fishing, I think. Now that I have the Titan's Mitt and I can pull in those big fish. Or, oh wait, there's the uh, the rocks over here. I got a piece of power. I love the pieces of power. I wish that was a thing still in Zelda. Although I guess with the cooking and stuff, you can do that. Ah, dang it. Nope, can't do it yet. I don't even care. Swing right by him. Heck you. Aw oh, yeah, secret seashell. But what do you do with it? You friggin' keep a secret. Keep it safe.
All right, Bow Wow. Oh, 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 I really appreciate what you did for my poor precious Bow Wow. You are such a nice boy. How can I ever pay you? I know. A smooch. You got a reward from Madam Meow Meow. L lucky. Oh my gosh, Link's blushing. He did get a big old smooch. She's an adult woman. That is inappropriate. Get out of here. Get out of here, Flauks. I'm not here for you. Fishing. Yeah. How about some fishing, little buddy? We'll only charge you ten rupees. Okay, here's how you do it. Hold A and release it to cast your line out. The longer you hold it, the further you'll cast. You can tug on your line by moving L. If you want to reel it in in a hurry, keep tapping A real quick. You've got this, little buddy. There we go. I want that bottle. Oh, I gotta let it actually sink down. No, no, don't do it. Alright, let's do it. Okay, I got the bottle. No! No! Uh, Frick. Yeah, let's keep going. Don't want to go too low because I don't want that fish to grab it. No, thank you. No, thank you. Fine. Come on. Come on. Let's get him. I did it! You landed a little fish. Just like you, it's small, but it's plenty of fight. Yeah. It's a 10.11 inch runt. You got a dream bigger than that! A fish like that's worth, let's see here, 11 rupees. Hmm, is this some kind of fish's mouth? Oh dang, got a piece of heart. Nice. I didn't even know that was a thing. Yeah. Why don't I keep guarding? Yeah, I made my money back, so. Why not? Oh, there's a fresh fish. Careful, careful. I don't want to get that big one, not yet. I will certainly later. There we go, got the bottle. Are you sure the bottle's moving? I don't want this green guy to get it. Go, 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 go. Ah. Oops. You'll get it next time, buddy. I'm not going to say that every time. I think if I get this big guy out of the way. Oh. Come on, then. Got him. Yeah, there we go. Nice. A uh, little fish. Plenty of fight. Even bigger. That's 13 rupees. So you get a rupee per inch rounded down. Even though that was almost a 14 incher. Right. Whatever, bro. I don't even care, bro. Bro, I don't even care. Bite. Have a bite. Come on now. Take it. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, gotta get a little slack. Don't want to snap the line. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, so close. Right by the. Ah, right by the surface. Alright, now I want to get the bottle while there's nobody in the way. No, 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 no. Okay, whew. Just barely the, missed 
Get the hit zone on that one. Alright. Ooh, come on, come on. Okay. Let's go, 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 go. No! Ah. Uh, you'll get it next time. Yeah. Want that bottle. Want that bottle. I may as well get one of the fish so that I can make my money back. Hey, there we go. Uh, th oh, only 13. Well, now. No, 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 no. Ah, crap. Ah, uh, well, at least I can make my money back. Getting the small ones. Please, green one, don't do it. Okay. Alright. Wait so he moves. Oh, he's gonna turn back around. So I gotta do it. Wait for it, wait for it. Go, 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 go! Yes! Yes, it's mine! It's mine! Nice. It's good for storing fairies for later. Ah, uh, sure. Let's do one of these big boys. Just for fun. Make some money back. Come on now, bud. You know you want it. Yes! Immediate! You reeled in a big fish. It's so heavy that you wish you'd cut something lighter. That's a lunker. New lure. The fish a little deeper down will love this one. The first time you want to land on this size, huh? Let's mark the occasion with a piece of art. Oh, that'll give me a new heart, too. That's my fourth one. Heck yeah. yeah. Uh. Let's... Ah, let's keep going. I'm enjoying fishing. Let's go with the middle weight. I'll go for this guy right at the bottom. Alright. Come on now. Come on now. Come on, come on. Ah. Sure. Nope, nope, nope. Not you. 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 Insatiable, you. Your time is now, your insides out. Darling, how you grew. Yep. 11. Uh, whoops. Never mind. Oh, oh. Oh, no. Okay. 
I guess the dead zone's a little too uh, tight on this, so when I hit it, it flicks just enough back up. I'm all fished out. All right, I'm going to the prairies next. Where's the prairie at? Over to the west. Well, I guess everything's to the west because this town is on the east coast. Of this island. Uh, let's crane game. Heck yeah, I'm, I'm feeling some, like, side content right now. Yeah? Gonna try and make a little money back real quick. Hey, Southpaw's online. I don't remember who that is. Trendy game, one play, ten rupees. The buttons move the crane, the rest is just timing. Go over the buttons to play, good luck. All right, let's uh, move right. There we go. Get the Yashi. He's a bit top heavy, so he might flop flop out. Oh, 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 oh. No, oh, yep. Yeah, like, oh, hey, I got it anyways. Did I? Uh oh. <laughs> okay. It was stuck for a minute because he didn't flop out. Oh, I thought it would be stuck there. Good luck. All right, let's, um,. It's just immediately. Yeah, just a single tap of X should do it. Just want to get him a little further along the conveyor belt. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Challenge again? Yes. We're going to go for the heart piece. Now it moves a lot quicker than I remember. Oh, uh oh. Might be a bit high up. <laughs> it's weird seeing heart pieces as actual physical objects. Like you only ever like grab one and you're done, but like seeing it have actual physics and stuff, it, it makes a lot of questions, you know? All right, let's get this uh, purple rupee to make our money back. Oh, that's perfect. That's perfect. Oh, come on. That was perfect. Perfectly on there. I feel cheated. Come on, come on. Oh boy. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay. Woo, could have been bad. <laughs> yep, let's get that 50 rupees. If I can't get it on this one, it's not worth it. I don't need that shield. I already have a shield. Ah, perfect. Ooh, ooh, uh oh. Uh oh. Don't, 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 don't flop out. Okay. Got it. That's it. I'm done. Now oh, it's still in the belt a little bit. Uh, no. Just give me a holler whenever the mood strikes you to play. Yoshi doll. You can't count how many games you've seen him in now. My wallet is bursting. Uh, not really. Piece of heart. What a rare find. Hmm. Wow, you won the Yoshi doll! We've been trying to do that forever! Our mom is real desperate to have one. Oh well. Isn't it her lucky day? She'll have to give me something in return. Like some baked goods. I enjoy a good cupcake. Have you got, have you got some? Have you got some cupcakes? I'll take exactly one. Um, 
No, nope, this is Marin and Taryn's house. Mm -hmm. I wish hungry some fairy short. So I went and got bananas at the beach. Stormsicle, if you want some, you should go and get some. Should go get some. Um, let me... Hold on, where's... The... Who wanted the... Marin and Talon live there. Up here, I guess? Hmm. Whoa, the forest looks real spooky. That's pretty cool. Hey, there we go. Uh? Oh, will you give that Yoshi doll to my baby? Baby doesn't care. Oh, thank you. You are indeed a generous person. Ah, I'll give you this in return. You trade your Yoshi doll for a ribbon. Maybe you can trade the ribbon for something else. Oh, look at that. Four little beds and the two big beds. That's cute. Does this stand for something? It says Shy Guy. Shy Guy. The easiest way to never get broke in this game is to just whack bushes anytime you find them. Um, can't learn your song yet, so I'm not gonna waste my time talking to ya. I uh, gotta give the bow to... Bow to the baby. Makeup, jewels, dresses, I want it all! Oh, that ribbon, I need it. Will you trade for my dog food? Yes. Lucky, thanks. Well, here's your dog food. You exchange a ribbon for some dog food. It's full of juicy beef. <laughs> I need to stop making that face. It's really gross. <laughs> um, okay. Well, I'll go grab some bananas while giving this guy some canned food. Or, wait. I go down this way and then back up. Yeah, over to the right. Let me get some bananas. Can't get bananas. Oh, he gives me bananas. What's that you have? It's canned food. For heaven's sake, man, give that to me, please. Gonna lose it if I can't get that can. Oh, thank you. I'll take that. Crunch. Crunchy. Nice. Much, much. That was great. I know it's not a fair trade, but here's some bananas. Mmm. Give him dog food and got bananas in return. Good deal. I'll accept that. And do you want bananas? Do you want bananas, monkey? Does not want bananas. Oh, getting close to another break. Um, in like 20 minutes. The thing about weight training is you just end up so hungry. I eat like every two hours and I'm just like, within the last five minutes of them, like, oh my god, I'm so hungry. I try not to eat more often than that. Because that makes like six meals a day or something, but they're all like pretty small. Sometimes it's just like peanut butter crackers or something. So like, and, and I'm trying my best to do mostly home cooking and not, you know, like junk food. But then Taco Bell is like right there. Uh, I'm like, I live so close to a Taco Bell and I'm just like, it's only like a couple bucks and I can get a couple of super salty, satisfying burritos. And they're just so, that's the thing is like, it's mostly like beans and rice and like some like meat. And I don't, I try not even to get the meat most of the time. But it's like, it's just all so salty, and they just pack it with all these preservatives. Ugh. I can't help it though, man, I grew up on Taco Bell. 
And now nacho fries are back. What do you want from me? This is not paid by Taco Bell, by the way. I just enjoy their food. I swear, no brand deal. Although Taco Bell, dude, if you want, if you want to like, um, sponsor the stream, I am here for it, dude. I will absolutely accept a Taco Bell sponsorship. Are you kidding? I would love to be sponsored by Taco Bell. It could mean that I get free Taco Bell. Nice. Although, I will get so fucking fat. <laughs> I mean, granted, I'm already, like, I got a gut. And I work out a lot, and, like, especially with how much I'm eating lately, it's like... That's the thing, though. There's abs underneath. It's just, like, I drink so much water. Speaking of, I should have a sip. But it's, like, bodybuilders, the dudes who are, like, the most cut, like, they are super focused on water retention. So they avoid sodium like crazy because that makes you retain water. Although that's good because it me makes you more hydrated. And like before, they'll like dehydrate themselves for a couple days before like a show to just have all their stuff popping and glistening and like glazed or whatever. And it's like, it's so, so unhealthy. Um. So like, yeah, no, I just, I'm just probably never gonna be cut like that because I don't wanna do that to myself. And with my job the way it is, I can't. If I, de if I dehydrate myself, my voice would be useless. And I, yeah, no, I need to be able to talk professionally. Ah, uh, get out of here, goofy zombie. And nobody asked for you. Is this where I was going? Co oh, wait. Is it Kohalint? Or is it Ukuku that I want? Nope, no secrets there. Let me I for a rock. Nope. Ooh, a couple blues. Nice. It's like buying a quarter on the ground. Crazy Tracy! Aw, oh, yeah. I love Crazy Tracy. <sighs> Hi there, big guy. I'm Crazy Tracy. I've got a little secret for sale that'll pump you up. How about it? 42 rupees for my little secret. Uh, sure. Very specific amount. Alright, come here and I'll rub it on you. There, I've applied my own secret medicine. It will take effect when you lose all heart. Drop by again, big guy. Here's some bonus treatment. Behold, your hearts are full. Well, they already were. She's got two kangaroo rats. Hell yeah. Um, That's great. Yeah, it's good to stop by Crazy Tracy because now if I die, I'm just going to be uh, brought back. That's pretty good. I don't know if that counts towards the don't die ever count, which... I need to be careful of if I want that secret ending, but, um, I think I'll be fine. Uh, I think it's just if you get the game over screen, specifically. Which, as with most Zeldas, it just goes dark for a minute and then... Boop, 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 boop. You've got a fairy! Or whatever. Hey, you should find out what it does. Why it teleports. <laughs> Although, since this is the only teleport spot, yeah, it's not going to take me anywhere. Ah, so much grass to mow. Um, that's the slime shrine. Can't do that yet. Pothole field. Jump over that. And this is another mini ga game. 
I'm pretty sure. Let's check it out. And see what it's all about. Hey, bud. Haha. <laughs> Salutations. You wouldn't know by the look of me, but I used to live in the castle. My servants went berserk, and I was forced to flee to my villa. So, you're looking for something, are you? I may have just what you were after. But first, I want you to retrieve the golden leaf I left behind in the castle when I fled. Smashing. To tell you the truth, there are five leaves, and I want them all. Okay, you'll need to do some digging, so buy a shovel. Are you off then? Mm, good luck. Uh, TBH. I'm on the servant's side. Eat the rich. E eat the Richard. His name was Richard. Which also goes to Dick. Which is probably still accurate. Eat the rich. Eat the rich. Pretty sure it's just north. Over this way. Um, I need to blow that up later. Need some bombs. I think this is where I get the bombs, is at the castle. Ah, get out of here. Get out of here, spooky. 50 paces. Is it actually? Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Definitely more than that. How do I get inside? I guess if we're including part of the courtyard. Hey, it's a monkey. Does he want the banana? Yep, there it is. Kiki! Repay him! Y'all didn't need to give him the bright red cheeks. Monkey dance. Monkey business, done! Bye bye. Woo, Kiki. <laughs> you got a stick. You found a stick. You take it. Nice. Another thing I'd like to do at some point is Action Castle. It's like a um one of the classic text adventures, but it's more like a uh, RPG. So um, hold on, I'm gonna. There we go. Apologies. Um, it's more like a, a tabletop RPG, so someone basically game masters it, and everybody else takes turns. So with chat, it'd be really fun, but I gotta make sure I get like a pretty dense chat going to be able to do that. But yeah, everybody gets like one action, and then the next person takes a turn. And you have to format it the same, like, go west nonsense. Ah, stop it. Stop it. There's a leaf. I found one. I did say I'd need to dig, so I'll just dig in the obvious places for now, and then maybe a little less obvious later. Sneaky guy. Sneaky guy with bombs. But, oh, no. Just gotta hope to luck out. It's just whack a mole. Got to whack 
the mole. Where I gotta dig. There's a gun too. Pretty sure there's one inside. I'm pretty sure they don't ever have them more than one on a single screen. Stop it. I am digging. Okay. Thankfully, you don't have to dig off screen. Ah, oh, good, and the crow doesn't come back, so that's good. It's, yeah, that's what I said. Ah! When I'm focused, I just say some dumb stuff. It's good, the thing is good when it's good, when it's good, when it's good, right? You know what I'm saying? Okay, can't dig the flowers, got it. I mean, can't dig them with the shovel. You can dig them emotionally, metaphorically, figuratively. And I do. I think flowers is, flowers is nice. They're very pretty, and I appreciate it. Oh, I feel like I'm gonna feel like a fool when I find out where it is. Cause I... But then again, it might just be in a very random spot. I don't know. You definitely said you would have to dig, so... Gotta dig up the whole dang place. It's also interesting, even though he, in most games, would be considered looking at me. Yeah, until you go onto what would be the screen doesn't spot you. You can feel the energy flowing through you. Maybe it's here. That makes sense. There's nothing over here, so. You can, uh, you can streams. Hey, thanks for following. Aim for the limit. Welcome to the stream. Doing a real chill Link's Awakening stream. Uh, sounds like my alert box was having a lot of troubles speaking there. So I might have to uh, adjust things there. Make sure that the, the audio clip is on the correct hard drive and everything. Come on, where is this other golden leaf? You directly said you gotta dig for it, so... And everything I can. God, I really hope it's not up top behind the castle. In like the one spot I decided to not be super thorough with when I started digging around the whole place. That's just gonna be the way, isn't it? Yep, these leaves. I I got what? I got two. And I'm pretty sure there's two inside. But I like... Oh boy. Yeah, I do not remember where the one that you gotta dig for is. So I just kinda... Kinda going methodical. Dig up every single spot.
Are you kidding me? I've definitely done the... I've done the entire castle now. There's no way. There's no way. I can't have missed it. I literally have, like, dug up the entire castle. This is donkey sauce, dude. What? What's going on? What? Yeah, that's literally everywhere. There's not a single spot I haven't dug. No? Yeah. I don't... I don't know where else it could really be. Oh, God. Is it around the outside? Whatever. I'm going to go in and get what I can here. And, well, you can't dig inside. There's definitely two of them inside. But he directly says, like, you need a shovel. So, like... Uh, no, no! Please don't, don't. Okay. okay, there's one. And there's, like, a mini boss. Um... Let's switch to this to get the anti fairy. Into a regular fairy. Nice. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. There we go. I think you're sneaky, huh? Oh, good. That'll make things a little easier. <laughs> this is Castle Gate. Yep. <laughs> Don't need to read that line. Oh, oh, oh that messed with my brain. Uh, well, crap. I don't have bombs yet. Stop it. Maybe this is where I get bombs. Botal. Smack. Any, like, hearts? There's a heart. Yeah, I'm good. Alright. Clang, clang, clang. This knight kind of sounds like Mario taking damage from Mario 64. Listen. We found a bomb. That's helpful. Only one, though. Hmm. Well, let's use it on one of these guys. Oh, so I didn't need the shovel. I didn't need the shovel at all. He just lied. Wow. That ma that genuinely makes me really upset. God, 
I see why his servants revolted against him. What a piece of garbage, dude. Hate this guy. One, and then I'm gonna hit that anti fairy with the poof. There we go. Okay. Whew. Oh, I did dig for the secret entrance. He's still a jerk, so I'm not redacting that statement. Retracting. Redacting is a different thing, I think. I don't know. I am not a journalist. Anyone who told you I'm a journalist was saying so in error. Hmm. All right, you butthole. Take your leaves. Ah, uh, Trabian, I see you have recovered all of the leaves. Now move this statue and you will find your reward. Okay. Ah. Ah. Wow, expecting me to push rocks and everything. This is just a secret seashell? I mean, I do need all of them. I want 100% this, but like... That's it, man. That was a lot of work. Disappointed. Hey, thanks! I... I... I do do voiceover professionally, so... I, I hope that I can, uh... At least do a goof half, uh... A half-baked goof of a voice decently, you know? Ah, uh, I'm in the hole. The whole field. Uh, okay, before I get into all this, I am going to take another quick break, because I need to eat something. But it'll just be a couple minutes, so... Stick around, don't touch that internet dial, don't go anywhere. I'll be right back with more Link's Awakening in just a bit. Okay, BRB.
All right, I am back. Took a minute, had some peanut butter crackers, which were lovely, um, and walked out to get the mail. Got some sun, got some fresh air. Highly recommend y'all do the same. Felt really good. Ugh. Need to drink some water. For my comically huge water bottle. <laughs> I still, I do not yet have the confidence to take this to the gym with me, because I don't want to be the guy walking around thunking this down next to, like, a machine or something. Um. But when I, uh, have to walk to the gym next, I'm definitely gonna have to take it. Uh, it's good, though. It's just, I mean, it's just a day's worth of water. Gotta get it all done. Okay, now let's, uh, continue to do Potter's Field. Pot pothole field. Whoop! I was about to say you just gotta take it slow, but uh, apparently, even that doesn't help. Oh, cool. Yeah. Um. Yeah, that's, I mean, that's very basic stuff. I, unfortunately, with how, uh, how many people there are out there at so many different levels, doing any kind of how-to video has to be very broad. But, um, yeah, I, I would, uh, I hope that it lets you know some interesting stuff. Um, I will say... The thing to understand about voiceover in a quick primer is uh, voiceover as a as a pastime, super fun, like performing and do you know using microphones, learning how to use audio and stuff, super rewarding, super fun. Definitely recommend it. Voiceover as a job is pretty much oh you bastard man is basically just marketing. Like you just have to be able to market yourself. And it kind of sucks sometimes. It's not very fun, um, the marketing side of it. But as long as you can market yourself well and you have the skills, which you should definitely have the skills before you even consider doing it professionally. Like, the, the bar is so high. Everybody who does it professionally is just so... Like, actually professionally. People who make a full-time living off of it, not just people who are like, I make like 20 bucks every few weeks off of like Fiverr. That's not the same thing. That's still hobbyist. All right, and I'm not saying they shouldn't do it professionally. I'm just saying like, that's that's not really gonna pay the bills. So you, you gotta be honest with yourself and just, you gotta, you just gotta practice a lot. You practice a lot first, and then once you're actually doing pretty good, you've done a few, you know, projects yourself. The best way to do it is do your own projects, make your own different videos or animations or whatever, or like work with some friends to do so. Um, and you've done all that, you know, live performance. I know it's kind of difficult right now because uh, COVID is still a thing, but live performance is always gonna be the best kind of experience. You know, stand up. Uh, live theater, whatever. Um, but... Come on. Get back here. Get back here. Cool. Um, but once you have that, then just business. You just gotta learn marketing, you gotta learn how to market yourself. It's, you know, it's it's a lot of work. It's like... what it, What was it? It's like for every... On average, it's a full hour of unpaid work just to get a single minute of paid work. So the more work you can do getting yourself out there, the better. Uh, okay, that's that's all cool. Aim for the limit. Thanks very much for joining the stream. I, I'm gonna try streaming more coming up, so you know, hopefully it'll be along with your schedule. Yeah. Streams. Oh no, my my uh, my audio thing is still kind of chopping up. But uh, thank you, thank you for the bits, thank you for watching everything. Um, yeah, I hope to see you 
uh, in the chat in future streams. You have a good one. I still can't do that. I don't have the slime key. Or do I? I do not. Oh, I'm gonna sneeze. Hey, shoot! Is there a third one? Nope. Nope. Just two. Ugh. Oh, my allergies. It's because I walked outside for a minute. That pollen. It's rough. Yeah. I'm probably only going to go for another hour anyways. You know? I want it to be a pretty substantial stream, but I don't know if my voice has the energy for more than three hours. Um, hmm. What am I missing? I'm still in the prairie. Alright, let's go to the phone house. What's up, bud? What's up, bud? I do have a shovel. Great. Dig. I was already doing that. Good advice. I do really love the phone house music. Unfortunately, I'm not gonna probably hear it that often, considering I uh, I know this game pretty well. But at the same time, I am stuck right now, so maybe I'll have to use it more than I thought. Come on, this is all Ukuku Prairie, right? It's Canalette Castle. Was I supposed to get the slime key from Richard? Did I mess up and miss my prize? I probably, di you know what? I probably had to dig, didn't I? That owl was probably like, dig here, you dingus. Oh boy, all right, let's try that again. My woder. Uh, it's heavy enough that I'm trying to just get as much as I can each time I use it. Although when I'm on like the couch, it's a I'm just like slumped over, like laid back. So then it's like not even more than a few inches from my face. And here though, I don't have any surface that's like big enough to hold it. So, you know, it's a struggle. Let me see, can I remember the way? Whoop. Oh my god. I'm just being reckless at this point. clear out grass that's wild okay I'll have to remember that for later <sighs> yep I missed the most important thing what's he say in soil sleep secrets beneath your shells yeah okay I get it dig here could have just could just said dig dig okay here we go. Yeah, let's. I think we're probably gonna do this dungeon and then call it a day. That should be a plenty long stream. I, I'm pretty excited to get back to streaming, honestly. Like, now that I'm in, I'm working out in a way that I, I have enough energy to still do other stuff. Cause I've been I've been going hard. I mean I'm. Just, uh, full weight training and it's it's great like I'm feeling really strong my muscles you know large 
Can I get that in frame? Large. <laughs> um. But like, yeah, it's just it's it's exhausting. So ah, trying to do that while also having other stuff to do is uh, it's rough. But what I, I just do it in the morning so that it's like I got I got the hard part out of the way. And I can just focus on the rest of my day. It's pretty good. Bombs! Bombs! Also, these things, which I always thought looked kind of like a bullet. You know? Oh. I needed one of those pots for uh, this. Right here. There we go. Whoop. Ooh, okay. Took himself out. Watch out. Watch out! Ooh. Didn't even get an explosion sound effect. Weird. I've got a key. I've got a smallish key now. I've got a smaller key than the one I've had. Um. All right. Oh, I haven't watched Charlie and the Chocolate Factory in forever. Or no, Willy Wonka. The one that mo focuses more on Charlie is Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory, and the one that focuses more on Willy Wonka is Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Does that make sense? I don't know. I'm curious if Tim Burton did that on purpose. I, I really find his version pretty disappointing. Let's go down first. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Whoa. Got it. No, my bomb! Give me the bomb. Yes. There we go. Alright, and then we'll go left. Why not? Ouch, ouch, ouch. Hmm, how am I to do this? Maybe I gotta reflect their zaps? No, nope, that doesn't work. I probably have to wait until I get the Pegasus boots, which I will be getting somewhere in this dungeon. Right, I didn't even go through here. Ah, sorry. My peanut butter. My peanut butter quack is... Really gets you. Gunks you up a little bit. It's good, though. Protein, a little bit of carbs for the energy. Good stuff, good stuff. As long as you're not allergic to it, of course. But, uh... Yeah, if you're not allergic to peanuts, peanut butter crackers are a great little snack. Now, will these combine, or will one... Yeah, one overwrote the other. Okay. Hmm. How do I... Maybe if I have this, foosh, foosh. Let's look in with the bottle last time. Foosh, foosh, foosh. Does it just have to be? Gotta get him. I just gotta be fast. Whoops. Yep, just gotta be fast. Oh, I gotta do the, like, down strike. Like this. 
Nice. One more. One more. Oh, no, no! Oh, dang. No! God, get closer to the edge, you fool. Let me slash you. Can I, like, redirect him or something? He's always staying, like, one square away. I feel like there's got to be a better way to tackle these guys. <clears throat> Come on now. Come on, I got it. <sighs> if I do this. Yeah, I gotta get him in the air. this. Uh, come on. Oh, come on. Now, if I get within one square of him, he disappears. Oh, come on! Let me get him! I think I might have just had a bad cycle. Gotta just do it from the top. What even are these guys? The big old tomato nose. Gonna slash like right before you get into the square. So like, Damn, how did I get the first one? Oh, come on, dude. Bombs. I'm an idiot. This is the bomb dungeon. Gotta blow him up. Or I guess I gotta do it from here. There we go. I think I have enough for the last guy, though. Um, well, I think I can just get him with the slash. Oh, Cursed beast! Oh, come on, dude! Please! Please die! Just messed this up. I just really guffed it up, man. I don't know.
Okay, I need at least four bombs. So hopefully these pots always have bombs. They do not. Grit. All right. Maybe if I do it like this. Please give me more bombs. Nope. Curses! Maybe I can do it with just two. If I'm real careful. Oh, I gotta play it careful. I gotta play it very careful now. Please give me a heart. I'd like a couple of hearts and some bombs, please. Give me some hearts. Skeletons, give me some hearts. Money. Whoa, when did I get almost 500 rupees? Oh my god. I guess it was all that grass I had to destroy for the, the Richard tr tricksters. Well, how about that? Okay. Please. Oh. Okay, there we go. There we go. And one more should do it for the both. Yes, perfect. Oh my god, finally! Oh, and then the little green goo. Nope. No, you don't. Oh, my God. Oh, what a headache. I can add a stream marker for that. I'm going to definitely highlight that later. What a pain. I got it. I got it, though. I'm going to have a bit of tea to celebrate. Ah, that's the end of that. Probably a lot of caffeine. There's like five servings in there. <laughs> 250. Maybe like, yeah, like 250. Wait. No, 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 it'd be like almost 300 grams, but I split it over a couple days, so it's probably fine. And then let's go upstairs real quick to grab that chest. Uh, I don't need the owl statue, but thank you. All right. Uh, no, not one of these guys again. That's fine, I don't have to kill him. Just have to survive him. Another key. Lucky me. Oh, there's a whole area up here. Oh, right. This this dungeon. I remember now. Let's 
So, yeah, I want to do this. To get through. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I don't have enough bombs for these guys. We're going to have to come back to that situation. There we go. Jeez, they're a bit far apart. I think I can see them. Yes! Yes! That's all the grief. Gone. No more grief for me, thank you. I'm quite full of grief already. Whoa, Goofy Skeleton. Oh, Guardian Acorn, sweet. Get out of here. Ten bombs, that's what I need. Whatever this is. Fifty dollars! Although I think I'm right. No, no, you can do 999 in this game. Sweet. I love his exertion. The it's good exertion noise. Grub. And then glow. Glow. Go stick it right in his gob. Oops. Okay, the bombs in this one don't blow up in your hands. The fuse actually goes out when you pick them back up. That's pretty useful. Nice. Yeah, I never knew that. Hmm. Uh, I do not need that right now, but it's pretty cool. There it is. The Pegasus Boots! They're going for a long jump! Alright. We're trucking right along, dude. I think, yeah, I'm pretty, pretty set to finish this in a... In about 20 minutes, that'll be the perfect time to stop. Awesome. Love how this is pacing out. All right, I'll finish up the stream. And then probably go hang out in the living room and play Professor Layton the rest of the day. I finally got the first Professor Layton. I've, I've played a bunch of the other ones, but I never uh, got all the way through the first one. And I had to sell them, because, you know, poor. That whole nonsense. Oh, wow, don't have money? No, I didn't. It was very unfortunate. Like, that's the thing, is, like, money should not be your goal in life, but not having money is one of the most, like, just depressing, demoralizing things that can happen to a person in our society. It's just miserable every day when you're broke. 
Like, you can't do anything. Like, at least with video games, it's like, if you can scrounge together 60 bucks for, like, a month, there are a bunch of games that you could play for, like, ever. But, even then, it's like... Like, even getting that together for some people is really hard. And, like, yeah, they still need to feed themselves, which can be really difficult, so... Anybody out there, man, who's poor, it's like, I, I really feel for you. I've been there. It really sucks. And I'm not, like, super well off now, but I'm thankfully in a situation where, you know, I got I got something in the bank. And it's it, it takes a load off your mind. Whoops. Whoops. I went for the long jump. They told me to. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Go away. No. Water time. Sorry, I just got kind of lost in thought there. Um, just thinking about uh, since uh, Aim for the Limit was talking about voiceover videos, I was just thinking about how I haven't done one in a while. I uh, I did. Yeah, I did one. Well, I ha I have one that I've not finished editing, but I recorded it a long time ago now. Um, so, like, I don't know, I'm th already thinking about the next one. I might even just do it as a stream. I haven't done a voiceover stream in quite a while. There we go, pop. Another key. Have I missed anything? Yes. I haven't done this area or that. I guess there's a chest there. Okay, let's go back and do all that. Right. Got a pop pop. And then, oh, well, can't go by that way. 
Hopefully they will not respawn. They probably will. Oof, oof, oof. There, it's probably like the compass or something. You know, one of those standards. Hey, are you? Face sore. Yes, right. I fought you, Shadech. Can I? Okay, the Pegasus boots can also be the left trigger. That's useful. So let's swing back through here, because I'm pretty sure that's yeah, everything over here. So I'm gonna hop into the portal. And open all the locks. And then bite the boss. Nope, no, 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 no. Let me out, let me out. Let me out! No! Ugh, I hate those guys. Oh yeah, I'm glad I went back. I forgot I need three still. Mm, that's satisfying. See, if you had the presence of mind, you could probably just, like, um, save all those and do all four at once, and that would be super satisfying. Come on out, friend. I just want to slash you a bit. Just a little slash. Okay. Just gonna pop him. Nice. Pop, pop, pop. Let's see if there's anything else inside these. So I think, yeah, the enemies were the ones that had the rupees and everything. Oh well. Bats! No! Bats, rats, cats, and fats. Everyone you know goes to. Cats. Belly. In New York. Oh, an another key? Okay. Neener, neener, you can't find me. Nyeh, nyeh. Gee, I wonder if I clap you down. Sounds like a medical condition. Just gotta get in the middle. Gotta get in the middle. Right? Or no, I think I have to hit the eye to keep it going. And then, you do it in the middle. Oh, wait, you gotta do it. Okay. Frick! Okay, get him. Ah! He rejoins too fast. Oh my god. It's just bomb. Oh, that didn't do anything. There we go. Got him. Oh, geez. Watch out. He's coming. Oh, he's large. Should probably be using the rock's feather, huh? Yeah, classic. Video games. Know what I'm saying? Don't talk to me until I've had my video games. That's dumb. 
I got a heart. Nice. All right. Isabel. I got the sea lily's bell. <sighs> Waterfall. It is hidden in the waterfall. Good to know. Oh, oh, here comes the owl. How many instruments have you gotten so far? When you play the instruments in front of the egg, the wind fish will wake and you will leave this island. Now you must hasten to the Yana Desert! Dark monstrous inhabitants of the sand will show you the way, hoot hoot! All right. That's gonna do it for today. Let me actually make sure I save. Perfect. All right, so I want to thank you very much for inviting me into your home, your computer, your tablet, your laptop, your phone, your uh, game console, Roku, Apple TV, whatever it is used to watch today. I hope I brought some entertainment and levity into your life. I hope you'll consider following, which is the heart icon, wherever it's at, uh, to get notifications on the app or email or however. Uh, subscribing, which you can pay for or you get a free one through uh, Amazon Prime, so use that Prime sub. I would appreciate it. Um, follow me on Twitter at IggyDKid. Follow me on YouTube, youtube.com slash Iggy and the Ape. Got a bunch of fun stuff all over there. And in fact, let me just switch to face cam. Hi. Hi. Um, so yeah, follow, follow me in all of those places. Follow me here. I'd appreciate all of that. I hope you'll join me next time I stream, which uh, will probably be tomorrow um, or, you know, Monday. I, I don't know about uh, Monday for sure, though. Um, but regardless, thank you again for watching. And uh, hey, if nobody else has told you this, I'll tell you this. You're a good kid. Thanks for watching, everybody. Goodbye. Good night. Wait, actually, I got to I gotta rage you guys over. It's been so long since I've done it um, from here that I forgot to, uh, almost forgot to do the raid. So let's see who's, who's live right now. Hold on. I will go back to the... Uh, AFK, but I will leave my my mic on so y'all can hear me. Let's see. Uh, I'll send you to Pinksel. Sure. So y'all are gonna head over to Pinksel. Let them know I sent you. Have a fun time over there. You have a great day. All right, all right. Good night, everybody. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye.